raising awareness around the less common warning signs of a heart attack, the British Heart Foundation BHF, warned that a sudden feeling of anxiety, akin to a panic attack, could be a sign that the heart is starved of oxygen. Another potential symptom of a heart attack includes excessive coughing or wheezing, which is caused by a buildup of fluids in the lungs. Heart attack symptoms can persist over days, or they can come on suddenly and unexpectedly, experts at the BHF stated. More common symptoms to expect may include chest pain or discomfort chest pain that spreads to the neck, jaw, back, stomach, or arms feeling nauseous, light-headed or short of breath. Bear in mind that people have a different pain tolerance. What may feel like a slight discomfort to one person may be extremely painful for another. Don't delay because you think hospitals are too busy, the NHS still has systems in place to treat people for heart attacks, the charity assured. If you delay, you are more likely to suffer serious heart damage and more likely to need intensive care and to spend longer in hospital. High cholesterol, dietary changes to help prevent a full-blown life-threatening stroke steps to take when a heart attack occurs once you have alerted 999 of a possible heart attack, the affected person is best sitting down and resting. If nearby, the person suspected of having a heart attack should take 300 grams of aspirin while waiting for the ambulance to arrive. The BHF wants to dispel the myth that a heart attack is only going to be an extremely painful event that results in a person lying on the floor, unconscious. Anybody falling unconscious, and not breathing, are likely having a cardiac arrest. Vitamin B12 Deficiency Stroke the soles of the feet to check if you have very low levels, symptoms expert warns of the white-looking fungal infection more prevalent during winter, exclusive Omicron, two emerging common symptoms of the COVID variant now coming to light, COVID, St. John Ambulance explained, a cardiac arrest happens when someone's heart stops. Anybody attending to a cardiac arrest until paramedics arrived are likely to be instructed by the operator, on the phone, how to do CPR. The life-saving technique can be taught in a less stressful first aid course. Heart attack aftercare Even when overseen by medical staff, recovery from a heart attack can take months. Once you return home, it's usually recommended that you rest and only do light activities, said the NHS. This may include walking up and down the stairs a few times a day, or taking a short walk. Gradually increase the amount of activity you do each day over several weeks, the health body continued. How quickly you can do this will depend on the condition of your heart and your general health. Reducing your risk of a heart attack Whether you hope to prevent a heart attack from occurring in the first place, or hoping to avoid another one, there are modifiable risk factors you can change. For example, you will need to adhere to a nutrient-dense diet, full of healthy foods. This will help to lower cholesterol and high blood pressure, thereby minimizing your risk of a heart attack. If you would like more support on eating healthy, visit the NHS website.